Alright, ball test number one. Don't hit the camera. And welcome back to this week's Try Movie Marathon. For this week, we are going to focus on Adam Sandler. Adam Sandler is an actor who has appeared in many movies and even has his own production company to make those movies. So it seems fitting to dedicate all three movies of this week's marathon to Adam Sandler in order to get a small scope of the work he's done. So to start off, we have the drama, mystery, comedy film, Murder Mystery. Murder Mystery follows a cop and his wife as they work together to solve the mystery behind the death of a billionaire. Murder Mystery is not some amazing, groundbreaking film that's going to make you rethink what you know of life. And that's perfectly fine. It's not meant to have a deeper meaning. It sets out to do what it does, which is be an enjoyable movie to watch. So for that reason, I will give Murder Mystery a 7 out of 10. Next up on the list, we have the rom-com Fifty First Dates. Fifty First Dates is a movie about a man who finally finds a woman he is willing to commit long term to but before he can, he has some work to do. Fifty First States is a movie that took me by surprise. It is a rom-com, but it does take itself seriously, and the actors do a spectacular job of acting, as you can see the chemistry between them. For an Adam Sandler film, I was taken aback, and for that reason, I say it is definitely a must-watch, and it earns itself an 8 out of 10 on the scale. To end off this week, we have the action film, The Do-Over. The Do-Over is a movie about two best friends who fake their deaths in order to get away from their uh, normal lives. Unfortunately, this puts them in a situation that neither of them expected. The Do-Over is something else. The story itself is actually quite good, but I feel like it could have been fleshed out a little better or executed better. But unfortunately, in this film, the story gets overshadowed by the constant, dirty, raunchy jokes taking focus over the story itself. Regardless, it's still a fun movie to watch, as long as you don't mind the raunchiness of it. And I would say it earns itself a 6 out of 10 on the scale. Thank you everyone for watching this week's Try Movie Marathon. I really hope you enjoy it. Tune in next week as the theme will be sad movies. Make sure to bring a tissue box. Bye bye.